Hey YouTubers, welcome to Adventures with Barbara. Today I'm going to share with you the tripod stand that I bought. Uh, I'm excited because now I don't have to worry about propping my phone up or holding it and it would be all shaky. So anyways, this is the tripod stand. These are the instructions, actually easy to understand. Uh, it also comes with a cord to charge up the Bluetooth. And it also comes with a little carrying case, which actually is quite handy, or you can leave it in the box. So, the tripod stand on it is the Bluetooth, which I've already charged. It just pops in, pops out, real easy. Uh, now, that being said, you can see the little case right there. It's not very big. So, you can use it for a selfie stick. That's not as big. But it does come with the camera attachment, and it does not fit very large phones. But if you need it, and you can use it, and my phone's quite big, but the phone attachment can be rotated and locked into place however you desire. But anyways, you unfold it and you twist it, and this is the tabletop. Now I'm five four and a quarter, but I round up to five five, and it comes with four sections. In each section, you just twist to the right slightly, and that locks it in place. Uh, that one's the third, but you can't see it. And, oh, I'm sorry. It comes with one, two, three, four, five sections. So. That's one. Twist it in place. Two. Three. Four. And five. This is as tall. Almost as tall as me. Now, I've already linked it up to my phone. And as you can see, my phone is quite big. It's like three by six and a quarter or something like that. But you have this that you have to twist and it will extend. So I'm not quite sure how much, but mine does not fit. So you want to pair it with your phone and once you pair it with the Bluetooth, and there we are. Now, get it to where I can record. So, turn your Bluetooth on once you charge it up, and it's, it flash. Or at least it did. So, I'm going to take, sorry, oops, there you are, you can see me, and I just took my picture, now, if I want to record I just hit the record button and I can stop it and I'm looking at the monitor at my phone and I can stop it and start it with the remote which is actually kind of cool. So there we have it. Oh now I'm recording. My bad. So, I'm recording, and I can stop it, and I'm not sure if you can see it, 
there we are. Anyways, you get the picture. So it it comes in handy or will come in handy because there are so many cool things I want to show you. It's like my cutting and stuff. But to extend it or to get low, you just twist to the left and it slides. And once you get to the bottom, to keep it from not extending, twist it to the right and it won't come out. So it's self explanatory. The remote just cut it off and it didn't take long to charge. It did not take long to hook up. No rocket scientist and it just pops in. And once you're through, you can take the, the camera part off so you can get it all into the bag. I'm not worried about it because it's only going to be used for YouTube. So, for the most part, most of it fits in the bag. So, that works. So, go to my page and you can see the pictures that I took and get more details so and I will include a link at the bottom of this video so that you can check it out if you want anyways until next time see you later